Hello, I'm Ravi Vishweshwaraya Sharada Prasad. The recent spate of rapes and killings of poor, defenseless Dalit Harijan women by upper caste males reminded me of a, of a historical incident which occurred during the Maratha versus Mysuru wars. In uh, January 1792 AD, uh, a Peshwa army of the Marathas, uh, which was led by uh, Parshuram Bhave and Hari Pant, who belonged to the highest of high uh, Brahmins uh, caste, that conquered uh, Shimoga in Karnataka and most of the invading uh, Peshwa army consisted of Kshatriyas and uh, numerous Brahmins as commanders. In Shimoga, there was a Shudra village, um, a Dalit uh, Harijan village, uh, mainly belonging to the uh, Cobbler community. And the invading Peshwa army raped uh, all the uh, Shudra Dalit uh, Harijan women, and then they killed all these women. And according to one estimate, uh, more than 6,000 uh, Shudra women were killed and uh, were raped and killed by the conquering uh, Peshwa Marathas. And there was massive outrage and horror. But the outrage and horror was not over the rapes and killings of the Shudras uh, women. The outrage was that upper caste males had defiled themselves and soiled themselves by coming in physical contact with Shudras uh, in the course of uh, raping and killing these Shudra women. And uh, the Brahmin priests, they prescribed a very elaborate series of special rituals and uh, uh, very elaborate pujas, including bathing in the sacred Tunga river and to atone for their sins. And the sin was not that of raping and killing uh, Shudra women, which is not even considered to be a crime. The sin was that they came in physical contact with the Shudra women um, during the course of raping them and killing them. And it looks to me as if society has just not progressed at all in um, the last 230 years after this massive rape and killing uh, happened in January of uh, 1792 AD. Uh, please uh, follow me on Twitter, LinkedIn, and uh, YouTube. My Twitter account is at RVP. This is Ravi Vishweshwaraya Sharada Prasad saying goodbye.